And goodbye to Way to Way Way. It's a much less cramped night last night. <coughs> uh, off to Puruwai Hut. Um, might be there for lunch. I uh, think the plan is to keep on going a bit further to make the town or the trip into town the next day a bit shorter. We got mud first thing. Uh, the old fallen tree, the track goes under. And a little creek. Okay, it's downhill to the hut from here. First bit of openness. And then At this bit of a funky jungle gym to get over. Not so much just a tree, but it's uphill to get over around the roots. I might get a shot from up there. Hang on a sec. Okay, here's the roots. And climbing up the roots. Oh, and it's looking straight out. That's the reason we got the clear view, because the trees are... Trees falling down. Just remembered us. Yeah, haven't filmed much today. So about 2k to go to the hut. Ah, perfect timing for a waterfall. Right there. Anyway. Um, yeah, I've been like hiking with some people today, some faster, some slower, so yeah, walk with a little bit, uh, some people for a little bit, and then move on, or well, they pass me, some very different walking techniques, uh, I'm sort of a blast through the mud sort of person, others are like tiptoe across the rocks and uh, roots, like the floor's lava. Some are quick on the uphills, some are quicker on the technical. So it's, I guess it's a little waterfall day today. Just come through this, it's like exiting a car wash. Now the bit of a view. Oh, it looks like a bit of a bit of flat land there. It's getting close to the Otaki Forks. It's starting to, to spit a little bit.
still more to go. So this is tramway uh, from the logging from the olden days. There's still some like railway ties or sleepers and uh, rail on. Oh, here, right here we go. The small gauge. Oh, foot for um scale. Where's my foot? Right there. from the old forestry days that's the flat area I was seeing from uh, shit further up and then it goes down to a gorge to the river just come up a, a thing to avoid a slip hello <laughs> Oh, did you go the wrong way? I did. Oh no. That's a bit of a up and over and down detour on the slip. Uh, some of it had like clear tape markings and other bits you had to guess. But back on trail. And just like that. Wait till they get out to the middle. River. And upstream river. Upstream river. It's not too deep. I stop now. Okay, back to here. Um, about 700 meters to a um the hut I've heard it can be tricky to find but there's a lot of footprints in front of me okay so we come down from there and then it's a little trek along this fence Met some locals here, and I said I asked them how to get to Paraguay Hut because I was heading up that way, and they say no, it's down that way. But then after a few circles, and then I'm off the map, it's this way. So uh, locals don't always know where the trail goes. Five minutes. Uh, there was a long lunch break at the uh, Paraguay hut. Oh, I forgot to film there. Anyway, over the uh, another bridge. A 
there's like uh, overnight parking and like camping area on this side but because of the slip on the o Oteki Forks Road uh, it's all closed up and what are we going for? Fence line walk Pukia tour track Waio Turu track It's like an abandoned facility. Like this is usually all mowed grass. Alright, I'll take a look at this notice board and see what's up. It's a pretty good map. I am there. Oh, I am here. So we're uh, gonna go up this fence line track. Pukia tour. Up to the high peak, 812 meters, and then it's a downhill uh, here to the road. A little bit. There must be forestry in that uh, orange bit. And then once you get to the road, it's a uh, downhill into Waikanae. But I just want to get up the hill as far as I can today, maybe to the top. See how I go. And last time I was here, I went that way. Um, sort of leads up to it like a four-wheel drive track and an old, uh, yeah. It was a crappy hut when I was there last. I skipped it and kept on going. But um, I think four-wheel drive track, it uh, kind of goes to shit up a hut almost. And uh, this is my way. Just starting off a uh, good easy grade track. It's gonna zigzag up the hill for a bit. I'm not sure if it's gonna stay like this or um, turn into like bush track. Okay, leaving the fence line walk. To the Pukia Tour track. Uh, just above that sun there. Is that it? Oh shit. Zoom out. In between, the, oh yeah, there's the big slip. So this is looking to the east. A few like sort of flat spots up here, but looks like the pigs have been at it. <clears throat> All right, I'm about oh six meters off the trail. There's a triangle. Um, all set up. Let's go wide. There we go. Uh, six o'clock. I'm at the 700 meter elevation. Uh, the summit's about a k and a half away at 812 meters elevation. So I guess I'll, yeah, have 100 meters up in the morning and then down all the way to uh, Waikanae. First stop, New World, and uh, have a feed. But, yep, going to get a Nicely situated here. That's looking a bit funky. Um, might straighten that out and then um yeah. 